Ladies and gents, Sandy TV here with some more Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening. Last episode, we completed the third, du the third dungeon, which was the key cavern. And now we just need to figure out where to go. There you are, right on cue, Mr. Owl. Mr. Kapor Gaboro. I don't know if this owl actually has a name or not, but um, yeah, we have three of the instruments of the siren. Sirens. So that means only five more left, and you will leave this island. Now you must hasten to the Yarna Desert. Okay, there's a desert on an island. I mean, that, that doesn't sound too far-fetched, but whatever. Um, wait, no, I... Right here, right? We also did get the Pegasus boots, so... We could do some exploring, which is I, I guess that's what I'm gonna do. There's nothing wrong with exploring. Uh, let's see, where do I go though? That's the thing. We do have 500 rupees, so we are pretty close to getting... Oh, hello you. Um, we are pretty close... We're like halfway there to getting the bow. Oh, Link, I see you have a nice stick. Um, can I borrow it for a second? Oh, the stick I got for the bridge thing. Smart. Good job, ta ta Taryn. Um. Okay, I got the honeycomb. I'm not sure how it happened, but take it. Okay, whatever. Uh, that's a great fairy. Where do I go? Ooh, hello, that's... That's a thing I could use the Pegasus boots for. Just like that. Except I should probably be careful because I'm <laughs> taking more damage than I probably should. And we got 50 rupees. Not bad. Um... Okay, I guess I've just have to go out this way. Okay then. And let's just... No, stupid text box. Gotta wait for this anti-fairy. And done. Um, kinda need some hearts though. Like that. Okay, so 550 rupees. What can I do with this kind of moolah? Um, that looks suspicious. We are almost done with our first row of hearts. I just need to find a piece of heart here. Uh, can I... Can I, like, cut this grass down? Or dig? No? Okay. Eh, that's fine with me. Even though that piece of grass up there does look suspicious. So does this cave. Did I, like, never go in here? I guess I didn't. Okay, but 50 rupees, I'll take that. I'm pretty sure the limit is like 999. Huh, I guess I never went in that cave. Okay. Oh, please don't hurt me. Okay, so let's see. 980. Um, what I want to do... Eh, guess there's nothing up here. I guess I'm gonna start doing some fishing. Just because now I have enough money, I don't- I'm not worrying about how much money I have right now, so... Let's 
Let's catch all of this, uh, all the fish here. I, I know how to fish. I know I said I would do this before, but like now I'm actually gonna do it. Okay, so... Uh, let's grab the fish here. I'm pretty sure like I would get a reward for catching all of the fish. It's a run. So five rupees, not bad. I mean, I started this episode with 500 rupees, so... Yeah, I, at least I'm, I have more than what I started with, which is always a good thing. Okay, so you... Let's grab you, Mr. Fish. That's five more rupees, so I made... Back... Some of the money I spent. I made half of the money that I spent. You're next. Okay, let's fish you up. Okay, so that's five more rupees. I know how to fish. I caught three of them already. You don't need to tell me how. Okay, so next up is this... Uh, this one that's like all the way over here in the corner because... That one looks like it'll be harder for it to get away. Come on. Perfect. Oh, nope, you're fighting, you're fighting, you're fighting, you're fighting, you're fighting. Yeah, you're fighting this one. But, I got it. Ooh, it's a big one, and it has a piece- Oh, it has a piece of heart. Nice. On top of that, you get 20 rupee prize. Um, hmm. No, I feel like that piece of heart was the grand prize here, so not gonna worry about it anymore. Okay, so where's the... Uh, where's the desert? I have no idea where the desert is. I'm sorry. Um, is there anything up here? in the mysterious woods. I highly doubt it, but... I, uh, there might be something that I can grab now that I have the Pegasus boots. Like something in here? Oh wait, no, this leads... I know where that leads. Um... What? Um, let me. Okay. That's the great fairy place. Um, you? Aha! What is this? Um. Oh, wait a minute. There. What? Hey, kid, you woke me up from a fine nap. Thanks. Oh, this is this like in a Link to the Past where um you do something similar and then this thing is going to increase like how much Okay, you can carry more magic powder. Yeah, so this is a beneficial thing. Just like in Link to the Past. I think in the Link to the Past I forgot what this thing's name was called, but it allows you to carry more arrows or bombs lets you carry more of something okay then 40 oh wow that's a lot I'm not gonna run out of magic powder anytime soon uh, leave me alone Oops, grab you 600 rupees nice Um, can I clear that? No, I can't. Worth a shot. 
I guess I'm gonna need the hook shot for that one then. Cause that definitely looks like a hook a hook shot thing. Oops, give me the money. Um Where to go? Where to go? Take a look here. Um, I think what I'm gonna do actually, I'm gonna head back to Mabe Village because there I can at least take a look at the map of the um, a map of the world and figure out where the desert is. So, um, that, that sounds like a plan. Come on, hearts. Ooh, piece of power. Not like I need it, because I'm going to be going inside the library anyways, and that's going to cancel out my piece of power. But, at least it makes it easier to destroy those moblins. I think those are the moblins, right? Okay, so... Over here, this is where the library is. And... Atlas of Koholan Island. Let's take a look. Where is the desert? Oh. Is it... These sandy looking tiles over here, you're in the desert, yep. But I don't see the entrance to the fourth dungeon here. Face shrine. Level six is the face shrine, okay. Raft shop. Okay, so where's level four? Um. I don't see it anywhere here. That's level five. That wait. catfish's maw. That's level one. So, okay. No wait. T uh, waterfall, right? That's that's what the hint said after we beat the third dungeon. There's a waterfall around here somewhere. Right? That's the Gapanga Swamp area. Is this it? Level 4, Angler's Tunnel. Okay, so why do I have to go to the desert? Oh, hello! I didn't even see that there. Ha! Huh. Got it. This is not a chest, what? You... Oh, I bent the book. Do you want to read this book? Sure! Yes! New World of Color, Under the Five Gravestones. Okay, so... One, two... Okay, you know what? Let's investigate that. So I have to go to... I said this gravestone, so cemetery. Uh, one, two, three... Okay, try with all your might, open a new path. Whoever is worthy receives the power of color. I wonder what the world of color is. Interesting. So, I'm wondering, since the original Link's Awakening, because I'm playing the Game Boy Color version, since the original Link's Awakening was on the Game Boy, which is in black and white, was this dungeon included? Like, was... Because I've heard about this. This is supposed to be the... Um, the entrance to um, a dungeon that's like exclusive to the the Game Boy Color version. So I'm guessing it's an optional thing. The cemetery is okay. It's this way. Cause yeah, 
If so, that makes sense, because, I mean, that'd give you more reason to play the Game Boy Color version over the Game Boy version. So, that's what I'm thinking. Because I'm pretty sure, like, that's the only, like, Game Boy Color exclusive, maybe? You've got a Guardian Acorn. If there's any more Game Boy Color exclusive things, then... I don't know, someone let me know, but I do know, like, this, um, this, I think it's called, like, the Color Dungeon. I think that, I mean, that's definitely exclusive to the Game Boy Color, I mean, Color, Game Boy Color. And having this Guardian Acorn will probably come in handy for the dungeon as well. So the cemetery is... Okay, so I'm heading the right way. Oh, you know what? Since I'm here... This is where Crazy Tracy is. I can refill up on that secret potion. Crazy Tracy, I've got a little sink room for sale that'll pump you up. Um, yes, 28 rupees for a full heal when you die. That's really, really good. It'll take effect when you lose all heart. Don't try to drop by again. Definitely. Oh, I lost the piece of power. Whatever. Okay, so the cemetery... ...is... ...this way. Okay, that's... ...not five gravestones. There's... Okay, so... ...was it... ...down... Okay, so down... Can I kill these things, please? You take a lot of hits to kill, like... Jeez. Oh, thank you. So one... Okay, leave me alone. Two. Three. Four. And then, did I have to push this one down? Or was it up? Perfect! Oh, that's neat. It's all the one music. Well, now that we're here, you know what? I'm gonna end it off. I'm gonna end it off here, and next episode, we're gonna take on this Game Boy Color exclusive dungeon. So, see you guys next time for some more Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening Deluxe. Because remember, this is the Game Boy Color version. Ooh. Later.